A very good evening. It is time for business news and my name is Nina Shaban. Now we start off with the value of unclaimed financial assets has risen by 7 billion shillings to 62 billion shillings in the last two years. Unclaimed Financial Assets Authority attributes the rise to dormant bank accounts that have been abandoned by their owners for one reason or another. What's more, efforts to reach the owners of the assets have proved fertile at times with the owners turning hostile towards the UFAA officials. I sat down with the unclaimed Financial Assets Authority Chief Executive Officer John Mwangi and began by asking him how long it takes before financial assets curb be classified as unclaimed. The law is saying now there is an unclaimed Financial Assets Authority whose role is first to receive. So holders, we are told, identify those assets in your records and identify through passage of time. So assets become unclaimed purely because of passage of time. Time, time has passed, that? yeah, time has passed, mm -hmm. and you've not seen the owner of the asset. So like for bank accounts mm -hmm. and gift vouchers, you remember those gift vouchers you used to get in the supermarket, mm -hmm. even a gift voucher, you don't cash it. So for those two, it's five years. So if within five years, you're given a gift voucher, you don't cash it in five years, that consideration become unclaimed assets. Okay. For a bank account, or a savings, deposit, a savings account, or a current account, uh, is five years again okay for dividends and shares is three years okay so dividends can be declared by the counter that you have invested in but if not cashed mm -hmm. See, when you're given a check after six months it goes still mm -hmm. but doesn't mean that you've lost your dividends okay yeah. so if that check is not cashed for three years then it becomes unclaimed assets mm -hmm. same as shares you have shares either in listed companies or unlisted companies, mm -hmm. or even in circles, and then you leave that circle, and within three years, that circle, or that company, or that listed co company is not in touch with you. That dividend become unclaimed mm -hmm. assets. So different assets have got different time horizons, but the longest is five years. And um, from our understanding, you are currently holding a total of 62 billion shillings. Where is that money being held? And what are you doing with the money? We have collected 32 billion in cash, in cash yes. uh, over the last um, nine years mm -hmm. that we've been uh, in existence. Mm -hmm. And we have got also 1.7 billion units of shares. Okay? Mm -hmm. So when you value them at the price at the Nairobi Securities Exchange, they come to about 30 billion. Yes. So that's why now when you add 32 cash and uh, the 30 uh, share equivalent, portfolio about 62. Okay. So what happens is that you find that uh, why do assets become unclaimed? So number one is maybe you forgot, okay? You just forgot, you left 2000 Bob and you went and, or you changed the bank account. You are not happy with this bank, you went up another bank account and started transacting with this bank, but you forgot you had left some money in this other bank, okay? So it's, you forget. Number two is just you click ignore, okay? Ignorance, just say, yeah, I don't, you know it, but you're not bothered, okay? The other one could be that aspect of relocation, okay? You left, you left the country and went. Okay? or the place you are staying. Maybe you moved from Kitale, you came to Nairobi, or left Nairobi, you went to Mombasa, or you went to Kakamega, or, or you went to Mandera. So you, you located. It could be domestically, regionally, or globally. You went. Okay? And the fourth one could be death. Okay? Mm -hmm. The unforeseen uh, event of death. So those are the reasons why, first of all, you lose touch with the asset. Okay? So now you lose that asset, you go, somebody else loses. So the nature of unclaimed assets is small and small bits of money, but for very many people. Mm. So cumulatively, that's why the fund is very big. Okay? Like now it's 2,000 for you alone. Imagine you are 10 million okay? yeah. of you. So that's how the nature of unclaimed assets. And that's why, as you rightly say, you find that about 70% of this fund is less than 5,000. For the cash which you have received in the trust fund, the 32 billion, Currently, we have placed all that money in government securities. Okay? Okay. So we have put money in uh, treasury bills okay, and treasury bonds, 100% of the fund, so in those two asset categories. So that's what we have done with those. And your goal to reunite um, the unclaimed assets with their owners at this point, you say is 20%, but you're currently at 5% and below. Don't you think this is a bit ambitious? We are launching our third um, phase of our strategic plan. You've had plan one, that was for 2015. Mm -hmm. It was a three-year plan, 15 to 18. Then we had uh, 18 to 23, 
uh, five year plan and now we are doing 23 to 28 mm -hmm. another five year plan so in the two previous plans we are more of inward looking okay in the way that we want to strengthen the institutional capacity okay our internal controls our processes our systems map our stakeholders okay I get the needs what do our customers want so that now we anchor those things before now we can push for thrust and see now we unite more. So in this plan, um, having have now set in our internal controls and we feel now we are, we, are, we are confident with our systems, with our process and the journey we have walked over the last eight years, uh, the experience we have gathered over the years, then now we have seen indeed what the people are looking for so that we can unite them with their money. And one thing we have seen is that now when we are outward looking, we are saying that a lot of interest is coming on people finding out uh, who are we and what do we do. So we've done a lot of awareness to the general public and now we feel confident that now we can be bullish actually in our outlook. That yes now, now that people know who we are, then can they now start consuming our services. That's why you see us saying that in the next, in, the, in this five, five year plan, we want to shoot our unification from lows of below 5% to almost 